In our previous class, we have talked about the root system and the two kinds of root system and the functions of root system. At the last, I just end up with the video that roots can be modified to perform their functions. So today we will discuss about the modification of roots that how roots can be modified and why they modify. So let's start. Fine. So firstly that is the modification of roots. By modification the different kinds of roots are formed according to perform their functions. So firstly we will discuss about the first category that is climbing roots. What climbing roots are and why they are formed. As you, you also know that some plant stem is very very weak. So that plants they do not stand themselves. Uh, why? Okay, they do not stand themselves. Fine. So they need some support. So that type of stems that uh, to support the stem, the roots are the roots are modified. Fine. So now roots help them to attach the support of wall or to the tree trunk. So what climbing roots? Which plants having the climbing roots? The plants having the very very weak stem, they need support to grow. Fine. For the support, the roots help them to attach to support of the wall or the support of tree trunk. Many many plants you have also seen in your uh, in your surrounding you also have seen many many plants so the example of that plant which is having climbing root it is money plant black pepper and ivy so money plant to i think almost everyone has seen at their home money plant is having the very weak stem so money plant needs the support to grow money plant needs the support of a wall or the root or the the support of the trunk or anything it needs the support right so that is why the type of the root in money plant is climbing root now we will discuss the second category of modified root that is a storage root it is clear from the name that plant store its food in the form of roots fine so in the storage roots the storage of food is there the storage of food is there in the roots so which type of plants are having the storage roots plants like carrot radish beetroot they are having a special kind of roots that store food and that type of root is known as storage root next third category is crop roots now i think everyone has seen a big banyan tree and you have seen many many roots of banyan tree are there now why they why there are so many so many roots are there in the banyan tree there are so many roots in the banyan tree for the support they providing the additional support and that type of roots present in the banyan tree they are known as prop roots next is breathing root it is clear from the name that is for the breathing purpose fine you know that some plants they grow in a water fine so here some plants grow in a water logged soil now what this water log means water log means full of soil full of water now in this water logged soil water logged soil means that soil is full of water and it cannot hold the plant properly and there is also a deficiency of oxygen but plants also need some oxygen for the breathing purpose so poor oxygen is there in a water logged soil so for the for breathing and to take oxygen the roots grow above the ground level because above the ground level oxygen will be there so the roots they are grown above the ground level now that type of roots are known as breathing roots and the example of the breathing root is mangrove trees fine so it means mangrove trees are which kind of uh, which kind of roots they are having breathing roots today we have discussed the breathing breathing roots we have discussed prop roots and storage roots and climbing roots 
so with the help of these modifications the the functions of the roots are the functions of the roots are enhanced of roots the root may show modifications in their shape size structure and functions to adapt to various conditions roots are modified for food storage support climbing absorption of food from a host plant and respiration some of the root modifications are the following storage roots some roots are modified for storage the tap root of plants such as carrots turnips and radishes are swollen and fleshy as they store food plants use this food when required we also eat some of these roots supporting roots in plants like sugarcane and maize where the stem is tall and slender new roots grow downwards from the nodes of the stem they help to fix the plant firmly in the soil such roots are called stilt roots in some plants such as banyan tree roots arise from horizontal branches of the stem and grow towards the soil on touching the soil they penetrate into it and act as pillars these pillar like roots are called prop roots they support the heavy branches of the tree the banyan tree has prop roots which become thick they look like additional tree trunks and the tree looks like a lot of trees put together in plants like black pepper money plant and beetle the roots arise from the nodes these roots help the plant to climb up a support as the stems are too weak to stand on their own these roots are called climbing roots